guess you took one dribble and launched, but what was going through your mind? Get it up before the time went out. That was the only thing that was going through my mind. Um, you know, at a moment like that, um, you know, uh, I tried to get a defensive stop at the, you know, on the other end, guy scored, so I was just trying to get it back. Slightly different than the Wisconsin shot, but are you practicing these at this point? Nah, um, but I do shoot them every day after practice. Like when Keith's about practice in, I go run and run to the half court and, and throw a shot up. Do you usually make them no. or you've been saving them for this? Nah, <laughs> I, haven't made it, I haven't made it in practice since like the Wisconsin game, so. You joked out the Wisconsin game that you had your eyes closed on that one. How were your eyes today? No, nah, they were open. I was locked in on that shot. <laughs> Very locked in. You seem to be jawing a bit with Langley. <laughs> you seem to be jawing a bit with number zero. Did you have any final words for him? Or? Nah. No. Um, you know, it's all part of the game. You know, just going back and forth. Did you come down funny on your knee or did you bang your knee on the floor there? I just came down funny. Um, I, I got a start, landed on two feet um, instead of coming down, landing back on one feet. How scary was that? Dude, when did you realize, okay, I'm all right, and I can get back in there? Um, I mean, when I first fell, I, I just felt like, I, I, didn't, I didn't feel right like when I first fell, so I just had to, you know, take time and see, yeah, yeah, see what was going on, but to me, I, you know, I got right back in. So I did you feel like the shot felt good when you let it go? Did the shot feel good when you let it go? Yeah, definitely. Um, it, it, it just felt like it was right. I mean, it felt like it was the perfect time. What was that like afterwards, getting mobbed by everybody? And I, I think you guys hit the table over there. Yeah, we definitely hit the table. Um, I don't know what's up with those guys. Um, trying to tackle me on the court. You want to record it? No, it was good. It was good. It was, it was definitely a good feeling. You need games like this, right? Like, yeah. Not when you just blow somebody out, but also you guys were in control and then they pushed back. Were you encouraged to see the way that you guys responded after they took? Yeah, I mean, you know, I mean, I, I just love games where it's, it's, it's dog fights, you know, from, from the beginning to the end. Um, you know, anytime we we got on the run, you know, they came back on the run. Um, anytime they went on the run, you know, we came back on the run. So. You know, it was up and down all, all day. You get more out of this than yeah. Maine or yeah. St. Francis? For or sure, for sure. <laughs> Definitely get more into this. Um, you know, the pace is way faster and things like that um, is, what I'm, is what I like a lot. You went to the rim a lot today. Did you just feel like you could take your man, or was that just something in their defense that you knew that was available? I mean, no, that's just something I got to start doing, um, you know, over the course of the games and, and moving forward. Um, you know, instead of settling on for threes all, all the time, uh, you know, I can get to the basket and things like that, so that's what I wanted to show and keep, and keep showing. That's the most points they've given up all year. In fact, nobody scored more than 74. What did you guys do to speed them up and make them play your game? Um, just playing defense, um, you know, pressing and things like that. We, ain't, we really didn't do nothing, you know, that we that we don't ever do. Um, we just played our game. That was it. How much fun is it when, when you have someone like Isaiah Miller that you guys can battle like that? I mean, Thanks both of you guys had huge second halves, and I'm sure you kind of noticed it. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's definitely fun, you know, playing against uh, a guy like that who can do, you know, a little bit of everything. Um, you know, he was one of the, you know, top guards in the, um, top guards in the country, you know, at a, at a high level, mid major level, it doesn't matter. I, I, I feel like he's one of the, um, you know, one of the better guards in the country. Was there a point at halftime where we're like, man, one of these guys gonna miss a few three pointers? <laughs> Just yeah, a few? They were, they were hitting a lot, uh, you know, a lot of three pointers. You know, they came in the game, I think, hitting like nine a game, and you know, in the first half, we gave up eight in the first half. So, you know, we just went to the locker room. You know, Coach Keys, you know, got got on us, and we just made the adjustment. But and then conversely, Pat came out hot. Yeah. Both halves. Yeah. It was it like seeing Pat shoot like that? Right. What was it like seeing him shoot like that? Oh, Pat? Yeah. Um, you know, Pat's he had five threes. Yeah, Pat's a shooter. Um, he can shoot. I just wish he would shoot more. <laughs> I just wish, you know, Pat would shoot more. Um, you know, he. we need to just give him, keep keep encouraging him to shoot the ball. And I feel like, um, you know, it might go from five to six threes. And just like that. How do you come